All right. Um, well, shit. Um, so, in the last video, we talked about some things, and I can't exactly remember. And it was only a couple of days ago. So I talked about confusion. And things have steadily gotten worse since then. Um, Cause remember, I remember now it was, you know, a lot of good things coming, but so many things around me going wrong. <laughs> oh no yeah that was that's pretty much what it was um all the good things are still there I'm still really excited for them um but the bad things have gotten worse so 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 much worse um like I don't even know what to say, how to say it, if I should be saying it. Uh, but it... But it's something I don't even know how to say. Um, like... Um, yeah. Like, all the good things are still there. I have my first show to wrestle on since March of 2020. So, a year and, like, what, three months? Two months? Four months? Some months? A bunch of months. A long fucking time. Like, 15 months. I don't know. Um, and it's me... With my partner Jay, who I absolutely love tagging with, taking on Rough Crossing, no, Ruffo the Clown, and Yabo the Clown, because, you know, alter egos and such. Nipple. Um, I'm on a stack show with a bunch of really cool people. And, and I mean, wrestling is what I absolutely love. I've been working really hard. I haven't stopped working over the last couple of days. Sleeping, maybe. Um, I mean, that comes spread. <sighs> all right. Um, literally the day after I made that video about all the bad things and the good things, someone close to me. Attempted suicide. Survived from a suicide attempt, but technically didn't. I don't know. Every time I close my eyes, I see a dead body. And it sucks. But the person's not dead. So it's great, right? But the problems are still there, right? Like, we're not past that. So, is everything okay? Is there going to be another attempt? How do you help somebody who you've tried to help, but you don't know how to help? How do you help somebody when they don't even think you're trying to help? So many questions, so many... So many emotions. But, I mean, they survive. Joyous day. Celebrate. Move on. Be ready for the show. I'm going to be ready for the show. I'm going to be at the show. And I'm going to beat the fuck out of a couple clowns. 100%. But these real life, I mean, that is my real life. But these other things are still there. They're going to be there. 
people are always going to struggle and I'm I don't want to say I'm a terrible person for, you know, not being there for some of these people in some of these times, but at the same time, you've tried. Well, I mean, probably, hopefully, hopefully you've tried, or I've tried, or whatever the fucking word I'm looking for is now. Um, but... Like... They have to try too. You can't make people change how they feel. And so, so stressful, so confusing, and... I mean, like I said, like, the things I'm going through almost shouldn't even exist, because the outcome isn't what I see. The outcome is good. But it's hard to see that after you've seen the first thing. And I've seen it a lot. I've seen it a lot. I don't like seeing it. Not anymore. I mean, I guess never, but... And it's not... Alright, I look at death a lot different than a lot of people I'm sure and it's not like someone lived their life and died it's people are trying not to live and seeing that is different seeing a, you know a person who's lived their life die or dead is easier because That person lived. That person did things. And, I mean, the end's coming for all of us. We only live one time, as far as I know. So, like, I try not to get too crazy when it comes to stuff like that. But when, when it's someone you know so close to you who is attempting to just take that away prematurely... That's different to see, I think. I don't know. Maybe I'm just fucking stupid. Maybe I shouldn't even talk about this. I don't even know if I should upload this. Um, but these things are real. And they're happening. So, I don't know. Why not say something? Why not fucking, like... Here lately, I've been making a lot of videos, and, like, I've been talking, like, a lot about my mental health, or, you know, just stupid shit, or whatever, and, like, I try to touch base on some real-life important struggles, and I, I mean, I, everybody in the world has them, and I think that's kind of why I keep doing it, and, like, this platform really helps me, and, like... I could talk about things here that I don't talk about normally, which is really fucking crazy because here the entire world could find it if they ever fucking thought it, you know, if it ever happened. I don't know. Maybe because when you're talking to a person, those people are always talking or waiting to tell you a solution. They're not trying to hear what you're saying. They're always waiting to get their next, you know, their next sentence in, instead of truly listening to what you, people are telling them. Like, so maybe that is it. Maybe I could talk to myself and, you know, get a little clarity on a lot of things that are going on. And maybe because like even after the last video, a lot of the 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 confusion was kind of fading until the very next day when that happened. Um and really fucked everything up but <coughs> I mean I don't know you know it's kind of just weird but I do have a lot of things to look forward to and I mean that person has a lot of things to look forward to still unless of course this happens again immediately but I don't know I don't know how those things you know how this works and 
I I know that I'd like to have them see them get help, but I don't know if I can be there to help anymore after that. Like, but then again, you can never give up. Like, I don't know. It's so stupid. See? Um, so yeah, I mean, I'm going to keep focusing on me and I'm going to keep doing what I, I need to do to progress myself, to get ready for these opportunities that are coming. And, uh, I'm going to try and help those around me that are struggling and in ways that I can help instead of trying to, to, to like force situations or anything like, I don't know, it's all, it's all one day at a time, I suppose. Um, fuck. I don't know if I should upload this. I, uh, I want everybody out there, if anybody's struggling, seek help, change your mindset. Those around you, or if you're around someone who's struggling to, um, don't take any of my advice because I'm terrible. <laughs> but do what you can and be there. Most importantly, I guess. Be there. Let people know you're there. Because some people who are struggling don't know people are there. Even if you tell them you're there, they don't know you're there. So if you got people around you who are struggling, just be there. Let them know you're there. Maybe too much, you know? Not like in their face about how you're being there. Just... Letting them know you're there more than not. Um, but, I mean, also, if you're struggling, I mean, seek seek the help. Because the brain's a weird, weird place. And it's, it's powerful. And you never know who you might find who can help. Even if none of the people around you can help. Even if all the people in the world who are trying to help you are right next to you. Sometimes they can't get through to you, but someone can. So don't stop looking for the help, because we all deserve to make it to a certain point. We all deserve to have experiences. And that's also why I need to remember to focus on what I got coming up and to capitalize on these opportunities and to make myself better so that way these thoughts don't come into my head. I've never struggled with anything like that. Uh, I've only recently struggled with depression uh, and that was, you know, with wrestling being ripped away from me. And now that it's coming back, like things are getting lighter. But I also keep falling into a crazy headspace because I, I've learned that once you get into it, it's a little harder to get out of it. And it's still a process of growing. Um, I've come to the terms of social anxieties a lot recently just because of, you know, looking back and analyzing my past behaviors and stuff, um, I should probably go seek that help that I told you all to go do, but uh, do as I say, not as I do, but also I already told you not to do as I say because my advice is probably terrible because I've never helped anybody around me. <laughs> um, so yeah, yeah, all of those things. I don't know if, uh, maybe you'll see this, maybe you won't. I'm still contemplating that. Um, either way, Sunday, this Sunday, June 27th, 2021, I see the ring again. Two people stand across from me. I don't know, fuck, shit, up. Don't forget to smile. <laughs>